Hi, I'm Crystal, and today I want to talk about glue stick embossing. So this is my little embossing box. It's just a box top from some dog food with a piece of foil wrapped cardboard and a piece of tape that's sticky side up. So I'm going to put some embossing on these die cut letters. And to do that, I'm going to use a glue stick. So anything sticky will hold embossing powder. And I know that you know that intellectually, um, but sometimes you don't put two and two together and think, oh yeah, I could just use a glue stick to hold the embossing powder. But it works just fine. So you could use a Versamark pad, but sometimes dipping a die cut into a Versamark pad is very uh, untidy. You get better control with a glue stick. And of course there is a Versamark pen that you can use but that would require buying this special product and being able to find the special product and having it on hand and everything. While I always know where my glue stick is, I always have glue sticks around. So I do like to use the glue stick for embossing for that reason. Now the look of the finished product is not exactly the same as Versamark embossing um, because the glue has a little bit of water in it. And so of course, as the glue stick is heated, the glue stick itself is going to bubble up just a little bit. And so you get a little bit more of a rough appearance with glue stick embossing than you do with regular Versamark embossing. So let's heat these letters and then I will show you what the finished product looks like. So I'm doing these letters because I'm working on another baby book. I wanted them to all be consistent. So here are our embossed letters, or our partially embossed letters. And you can see that slightly rougher appearance from the glue stick embossing. But I think it's a nice effect and it's very easy and efficient. Thanks for joining me today.